I find a way of about to know themselves, like to know themselves and to actually manage some, like when you know, to, to actually you know, always have a group on the outside, but you can tone it down with, with how you operate and gain strength and think your inner being and how you think and how you react. Understand? So basically what I'm trying to say about we can have the same, we can put the same children who are struggling on the same scenario. I know it's going to be cool with the same like circumstances. But what will define maybe some of them, we can be chances and opportunities. But most of the time, what actually drives them out is their attitude towards whatever is happening. But that, that sound is a certain and done. But there's a, there's a certain rules to unlock that certain courage within a band. And that's what I've been like actually uh, been striving for. What makes you tick? How can you gain that power? What, from a scientific point of view, from a philosophical point of view, from an artistic, from a, 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 a anyway, from a dramatic point of view, from like using all the fields we have that we analyze the human behavior and what influences the human behavior. So because of that, like Okanye Barasema, he needs to make education more fun, more like more free and not boring. Like education system is boring and yeah. new ways of Teaching meditation, teaching psychology, teaching environmental psychology to kids is very important. But hey, you are born in this in this world, and you're gonna meet psychological beings, and they want to to call it. It's like a chess game. It's like you need to understand the rules. But this is how you're gonna be like people. But, but this is how you're gonna get hurt. But this is how you react to it. This is this is how you gain your inner peace. Because most of the time, we we like to add extra like weight on our problems by making thoughts that are irrelevant to what the problem itself and even our thinking can, can become toxic to ourselves but how do we develop my patterns that can able us to able us to overcome those things like overcome them within like the change from inside out not from outside inside but how can we make a change from it's a new like shift of perspective but we've been thinking of a change of outside but if you look at the outside, it's always a reflection of our inner being. Because if you look at the world, the world is so divided. Within ourselves, ourselves, we always divide it in our minds. We always have a conflict. We have a it, it's just the world is just a play of what is happening within ourselves. I think so, because what's happening ourselves influences our actions. Our actions actually influence the external. Like, yeah.